Hello and good day. Welcome to our video channel, God's Promises. And today's video will be Matthew chapter 11. Let's get started now. Matthew 11 begins with Jesus preaching to the crowds about John the Baptist, who had been sent as a messenger to prepare the way for Jesus. Jesus acknowledges John's importance in fulfilling prophecy and speaks of his own role as the Messiah, the one who had come to bring salvation to the people. The chapter also includes Jesus' response to John's doubts about his identity as the Messiah. John had sent his disciples to ask Jesus if he was indeed the one they had been waiting for, or if they should expect someone else. Jesus responds by pointing to the miracles he has performed and the fulfillment of prophecy as evidence of his divine nature. Jesus then goes on to condemn the towns where he had performed many miracles, yet they still refused to repent and turn to God. He contrasts these towns with the humble and faithful people who had received his message and believed in him. In the second half of the chapter, Jesus speaks to the crowds about the burden of religious leaders who place heavy rules and regulations on the people, rather than leading them to true righteousness. He invites all who are burdened and weary to come to him and find rest, promising that his yoke is easy and his burden is light. The teaching application of Matthew 11 centers around the themes of faith, repentance, and rest in Christ. First, Jesus highlights the importance of faith in him as the Messiah. Just as John had doubts and sought confirmation, so too do many people today struggle with doubts and questions about the nature of Jesus and his role in their lives. Jesus' response to John's disciples offers reassurance that he is who he claims to be, and encourages us to trust in him as our Savior and Lord. Second, Jesus emphasizes the need for repentance, warning against the dangers of rejecting God's message and continuing in sin. He offers a stark contrast between the stubbornness of those who refuse to repent and the humble faith of those who receive him. As we read this chapter, we are challenged to examine our own hearts and lives, and to turn away from anything that keeps us from a true relationship with God. Finally, Jesus offers an invitation to come to him for rest and refreshment. He acknowledges the weariness and burdens of life, and promises that he can provide a yoke that is easy and a burden that is light. As we seek to follow him, we can find rest from the pressures and struggles of life, trusting in his grace and provision. In summary, Matthew 11 teaches us the importance of faith, repentance, and rest in Christ. It invites us to trust in Jesus as the Messiah, to turn away from sin and towards God, and to find rest and refreshment in His love and grace. Thank you for visiting us today. Please share with us your favorite Bible verse below in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe, it really does help our channel grow. Looking forward to see you back, here for our next video. Always take good care.